Mixing with Maxine. Remember butter. We were once like lovers. We were quite a team. I'll take some butter smothered pasta, please, in a vat of chocolate cheese. mixing with Maxine. I know it's been a little while, but you know, the storm, no power. Um, today we are going to be making chocolate mousse. So the first thing you do is you put your butter, you have four tablespoons of butter, one and a half cups of semi-sweet chocolate, and then one and a half cups of marshmallows. And then we're going to let that melt down. So after your butter and your chocolate start melting, then you want to add four tablespoons of water. So after everything is melted, then you're going to put it off to the side and we can work with our heavy cream. So then once our mixture is done, we're going to put one cup of heavy cream and one teaspoon of vanilla extract. And then we're going to whip it until we have stiff peaks. Then we have our chocolate, and you just want to test the temperature. Yeah, it's still too hot, so you have to make sure that the chocolate isn't too hot for the whipped cream, otherwise it'll fall apart and your mousse will not be mousse, it will be liquid. So we're going to wait, and then we're going to check the temperature of the chocolate again, and then we'll see if we can fold it in. Okay, so now that our chocolate is cool enough to pour into the whipped cream and it's just warm, when you touch it, it's just warm, so it's perfect at this point. We can put it in our whipped cream and we're gonna gently fold it in, otherwise the peaks disappear. Okay, so now that everything is mixed together, you can put it in the fridge to cool until you're ready to serve or if you want to serve it now, then you can. As you can see, everything's mixed together. We folded everything, and now we can taste it. Mm. It's perfect. Well, thanks guys. I really hope you enjoyed the recipe. I want to say hi to Allie Dryer, and um, I hope you have a great day. Ciao!